Hey, 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 what's going on? What's going on? Dan McCall here. And in this video, what I want to talk about is a, is a new free app. It's free, so nothing to sell here or anything like that in this video. Um, it's called uh, Zaley Stock Stats. So the, the topic of this video is how to check your competitor stock on Amazon. So obviously that's a good thing. We all want to be able to check our competitor stock, especially if especially if you get like a, you know low ball or something like that or undercut or something like that and you don't know if you should wait out until they sell out or, or whatever or whatever the case may be. But anyway, I'm going to take you through just a quick run through on how it works so that you know so that it could be easier for you um, for when when you get it, if you get it, I recommend you get it because it's the, the the more we know, the better off we are, right? So anyway, um, I'm gonna get and go to screen share and get and get right to it. Okay, sharing my screen so you can see my screen now, and I'm gonna go to uh, for, first off. Here's the tool. I'll have it below the video. Oops, wrong spot. Here, here it is, right here. So I'll have the tool. Um, Below here, stock stocks stock stats is what it's what it's called on here. The website Zaley Stock Stats. But yeah, so stock stats is like where you would look on the on the Chrome Web Store. Um, like I said, I'll put an easy URL below the video here on YouTube um, so that you can easily get this uh, get this tool. But um, but basically the way it works is you just add it. You click this button here, then it goes over here. This is what it looks like in the corner. Um, once you have it, um, once you once you click here, uh, first off, some tools aren't like this this particular uh, particular tool. So just want to let you know that it's uh, no, no big deal. Uh, they just ask you to set up an account like really quickly. You just put your email, make a password, then they ask you for your first last name, and and then a, a, a user password. So so that you're paying you're paying the price of your email address, you know, for for it. For it being free, so anyway, who cares? It's a free tool, right? So, and you can unsubscribe from anything that you subscribe to by email too. So that, that doesn't matter. But but anyway, long story short, it's just some tools you just add them, then boom, they go right here, and that's it. But this one, they make you uh, give them their email address. So I just want to let you know about that. So uh, like, if I click here, I already did it. Um, so I'm not going to do it again. Okay, it just went right here. Boom. So he, this is how it works. Okay. So look, look here, here's a table on Amazon. You look up the table on Amazon. What you do, you go down to where you click to see the competitors, right? You know, uh, here, I'll get in backspace at one. So here's this regular table on Amazon. There's two competitors. So what you do is you, you click on the two competitors down here, pulls the two of them up, and then what you do is you click on this tool. Boom, pulls up another page, and then it shows you their stocks, you see? This one, Sleep Re Revolution, seller name. Um, Amazon has 39. So then you know how many people, you know, how, how much stock these people have. It's a very useful, especially if you have like, you know, five, ten people on the same listing as you. And you're like, should I liquidate this? Because it's, because it's you know, because they're undercutting me too much or, <clears throat> or whatever. Or if it's a private label listing that you have, you're like, what's well, this dude doing on my thing? You know, you might want to be like, all right, well, he only has a couple left. I'm not going to make a big deal about it. I'll just tell him to not put it, not list on it anymore, and you, and you can sell out. So it's good for private label in that particular sense as well. So, but anyway, a very useful tool. Just wanted to go ahead and share it. Like I said, I'll go ahead and put this so for you to make it easy. I'll put this below the, the YouTube video so that you can go ahead and easily grab, uh, go ahead and grab that. And I'm going to go ahead and come back to the video here, stop sharing, <clears throat> and I'll see you on the next video. Uh, thanks for visiting uh, our YouTube channel. Uh, be sure to go ahead and subscribe to our channel for more great content. There's a ton of, ton of great content on here, a few thousand dollars worth of video content easily on our channel. So I uh, so, uh, look forward to seeing you around on the next video or, or whatever. And that's it. Bye for now.